Polymer flooding in enhance oil recovery. Oil and gas recovery operations traditionally have been subdivided into three stages. They are, primary recovery, secondary recovery, and, enhanced oil recovery. The actual range of primary recovery factors is very wide, but the average would be around 15% of original oil in place. Secondary recovery factors are comparable to the primary, so an additional 15% of original oil is recovered by water flooding. This leaves 70% of original oil in place, unrecovered. Why are polymers used in the enhanced oil recovery process? Let us look at some of the fundamentals associated with the efficiencies of the EOR process. Oil recovery in any EOR displacement process depends on the volume of reservoir contacted by the injected fluid. A quantitative measure of this contact is the volumetric displacement, or, sweep efficiency, or E sub V. Volumetric sweep is a macroscopic efficiency defined as the fraction of reservoir pore volume PV, invaded by the injected fluid. E sub V is a function of time in a displacement process. Overall E a displacement efficiency in a process is the product of the volumetric sweep E sub V, and the microscopic efficiency E sub D. Volumetric sweep efficiency is a product of the aerial and vertical sweep efficiency. The illustration shows the factors affecting the water flooding process. The permeability of the rock is not uniform, and water tends to flow through those layers having higher permeability as shown in the illustration. This is called layering effect. Secondly, water being heavier than oil, it tends to slump down, this is called gravity segregation. Gravity segregation leads to early breakthrough of the injected fluid. The two effects reduce the vertical sweep efficiency. From the aerial view, it can be seen that the traditional water flood narrows its course, bypassing a large amount of unswept oil in the displacement zone. This reduces the aerial sweep efficiency. Why does viscous fingering happen? Viscous fingering can happen because of difference in viscosity ratio, formation heterogeneity, temperature difference, and difference in injection rate. Water that is used for water flood can be modified to improve the sweep of the oil in the displacement process. This can be done by adding polymers. This improves the water flood sweep and displaces more oil than conventional water flooding. A general approach is to inject polymer continuously at the initial polymer concentration for a limited period. Reducing the polymer concentration systematically as more pore volumes are injected as shown in the figure. After sufficient polymer has been injected, the polymer slug is displaced through the reservoir by injecting water. Thank you for watching the video. We are committed to bring forth more videos to enrich your knowledge. Please support us by subscribing to the channel and benefit from the videos. Don't forget to press the bell icon to get notified about a new video. Thank you.